Hey, hi, hey guys, here today we go, I'm going to show you how to make eco bricks. Environmentally friendly fuel log for your fire or for your wood burner or open fire. You can just use materials that you can easily find from anywhere, which is shredded up newspaper done by hand, just shredded, and we like to add some fine sawdust to the mix as well. These bricks are great because they burn for about an hour each and they're extremely solid once dry and light. And this is one and I'm going to do a test to see how many hammer hits it takes to destroy one. So, it took about five hits to destroy it. That's good, that is. That's good. Solid brick. Right. Now I'm going to uh, turn the mixer on and show you you putting in the putting in the uh, ingredients now. So here's the water going in. it was quicker to do it, mix up some earlier rather than do that because it takes about 20 minutes to mix in the cement mixer so yeah so this uh, is what some I made earlier because it'd be too long for you guys here right and now I'm going to show you how to press out a block with this machine it's called the Multimate Smart 2 this is and it's got this sim here, which is where the brick gets made, and the arm with the piston that pushes down to make the brick. So, first, I'm going to fill it. You need about two or three handfuls of this mix to make a good sized brick. firm it down and then you slowly push the handle down and it slowly compresses it driving out all the water and tip it to get extra water out do it a few times make sure it's really well compressed And then lift up the arm and pull out the sieve and you take out the finished product. There's one brick, perfect eco brick. Now I just put them on bits of old wood and let them dry out and then they can be used. I'll do another one just to show you. So about two to three handfuls of mix. Mm -hmm. 
and then slowly push it down. Check it. Give it a few more push down. So, this is great machine, I think. It cost, I think, this, this version cost, I think it's about £75 on eBay, this version was. And they're made in the UK, properly galvanised painted steel. And then, as you can see here, I collect up the water so I can reuse it in this bucket I've bent so you can get under the machine. Now guys, you do need to, when you're mixing, be careful because with water and you've got an electric lead, you need to be careful, particularly on the plugs, not to splash any water. So do be careful when you're doing this, but other than that, it's a great way of creating free fuel for your fire. Bye, see you in the next video.